hello and welcome back to my channel you guess it i have been shopping on zara again i just thought i'd explain to you why i have so many zara hauls and how it happens i'm not just like shopping on zara every day every time i do a haul i have to go back onto the website like a week later or whenever it is to add all the links to the description box and while i'm looking for them i'm like adding to my website like, oh that's nice oh that's nice and then if there's um like one thing i normally think save your money it's not worth it but if there's six things in the end i'm like i'll just order them and then i can do another haul keep some bits yeah so basically that's why i keep having consistent zara hauls also i do feel like it is one of my favorite high street shops to shop at um so yes another zara haul um yeah there was basically some boots that i saw i've been looking at for a while and then i saw them again while i was looking for links and i just thought i'll just order them see how they are get out my system can return them um but yeah they're pretty out there um i wanted them for coachella um and i was gonna wait till close to the time but then i thought maybe now is the time to get funky boots um because maybe in april i'll be looking at sandals everywhere another big box coming at you with everything you're about to see i will link down below in the description box if it's there sometimes by the time i do this it's sold out i'll try and link similars but yeah i get a lot of comments that are angry sometimes saying you haven't linked this and i'm like why would i link everything else i just missed that one it's obviously not there i'm sorry um anyway i want to talk about this jumper this is one of my favorites it's from h&m so i will link that down below too this is one of the things that i saw on the website when i was getting my links that i was like wow straight in the basket that is insane this is something special that i felt like you needed to see so i've already posted a picture of this on my instagram because when something great comes in i just cannot wait um but this jumper wow look at the color look at that plaiting detail i love it's huge my one comment about this though is a it's v-neck which isn't my favorite but i quite like it in an oversized thing when it slouches off the shoulder but it's 49.99 so that's expensive but it's um it's so soft it's obviously like an alpaca or something yeah it's 22 percent alpaca um, but it's just such a nice color such a nice Bit, oh, look at that big chunky sleeve with the tight on the bottom. My comment though is that it's short. So I ordered this in a medium. I'm pretty sure that was the biggest size they did, but I would advise you to go for a large to have it looking like it does in the picture. Because to me, this doesn't cover my crotch. And I prefer, if I'm getting a big oversized jumper, to cover that crotch area of my jeans. Um, I like a jumper to be short or, and able to like tuck in or belong. That middle ground just annoys me to be honest. But yeah, I just absolutely love the colour. I think it's so gorgeous and flattering. Love a good sickly Barbie pink. So I will show you how that fits. And I'll also put a picture in there now of me putting it on Instagram. I had styled it with tights there. But in reality, you couldn't wear it out like that. You'd need a skirt too. It's too short. But I am 5'8", so if you're shorter, then lucky you. So this is the pink jumper. Oh, I do love it, actually. I was talking about the lump, but could give it a bit of a tuck. It's very cool. I like jumpers when they sit like this because you can go out for, like, drinks on a Friday night in a nice, cosy, lovely jumper, but you you have got still that little bit of sexiness on show um oh what have I got annoying pet peeve don't follow the details around the back but the back is nice you could have it quite low but I think that looks super cute I just did my flies up so don't troll me if you've noticed that please okay the next thing I got I just thought was gorgeous this is like a shirt jacket type thing i really like these for when you want to go out but you don't want to put on a giant coat they keep you warm well not as warm as i would like to be probably but they do the job when you want to just not have a big coat with you i really like the color of this neutrals are just so winning at the moment 
Um, it is 79.99, which again I thought was expensive to be honest. Um, but it is a really nice piece and the colour means that it will probably last through quite a few seasons. I think it would be nice in spring too as a light over jacket and I also got this in a size medium. So I'll show you how that looks with the tights which is what I would want to wear it with really. So this is the shirt and tights situation. I think it looks super cute as a dress. It looks really nice with heels, all flats, and yeah, it's long enough. I would definitely put some shorts or something cute underneath just in case, but I do think it is long enough to go out like that. Um, so yeah, I do like this vibe. It's a really nice fabric. I'm gonna show you it open with something else that I'm gonna show you next. Okay, the next thing I got was this. It's a little sleeveless knit. I loved the tiny cable knit. I think it's so cute. Look at that. Also, while I'm here, do you like my nails? They're like little clouds. I love them so much. Anyway, so this was 17.99. I got it in a medium. You know I like these kind of tops a bit looser, but again, it doesn't look that loose. So I think I'm gonna have to just like go to the gym and make every part of my body toned and accept that everything's gonna be tight on me. Um, but yeah, I thought that would look quite nice under that um, oh, that shirt thing. So I'll try that on for you with a pair of jeans because you've already seen that shirt with tight. So this is what the little cable knit jumper looks like with the shirt and a pair of jeans. Just a nice, simple, non-extra look that I would wear pretty much daily. So this is a little knitted cami top with the neck. I actually quite like it. I didn't think it was going to be very flattering. It's really simple. It looks really chic. I think it looks really nice with the shirt over the top just a nice simple basic neutrals look really into that look i just got a nice big brown bag this is from a website called hv hvisk i'm not gonna try and say that it's a bit squished from being in the package but i think that goes in there i just feel like this kind of vibe looks super nice and this has got a long strap with it. So yeah, all the neutral tones, I think it looks nice. Let me know what you think. And I got this coat. This is a pretty basic black wool smart coat. I got it in a size medium. It was $79.99 reduced to $25.99. And for that price, I just thought, I actually want a really nice black, good quality smart coat. But just looking at this coat, has reminded me why I don't have one. Because even just being in the box with these other bits, it's just covered in fluff. I don't know if you can see, yeah. But that just like drives me insane. Drives me insane. And black coats remind me a little bit of going to school. I don't know why, I think that's so weird, but they just make me think of school coats. So I could only have a black one to go to school. But yeah, I do like the look of like a really black, masculine, oversized jacket. But I have already tried this on and I'm going to say it's not as oversized as I thought it would be. But I will try it on over that last outfit to show you what it would look like with a load of layers and stuff. Because I think it's cool, it was £25. So I'll probably keep that one. This is what the black coat looks like. £25. Can't go wrong really. Just nice and simple and chic. It's quite masculine, but not as masculine as I would have thought. I do think it'll look cool with some beats like that. Um, so yeah, like an all black look, but there's no point me showing that because honestly guys, this camera just, I have to make shapes so you can still see me because otherwise I just look like a big black blob in this. Okay, the next thing is the whole reason I got this package. And they are, I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what I was expecting, but I feel like they're bigger than I was expecting. Like, if my boyfriend watches this, which I don't think he's ever watched a single YouTube video of mine, he will instantly message me being like, what the hell are those boots? I hope you return them. But 
Also, he likes things like Burning Man Festival, so I'm like, maybe he get he might get the vibe because that's the vibe I'm going for, like the Burning Man look. I mean, they're definitely a Prada dupe. Oh, they smell like I'm gonna get high. You know, like that oh, rubbery new plastic smell. Um, so yeah, this is them. Um, they do it with a zip, so you don't have to do that. I'm. This is my envision when I go to a bowl festival on Coachella. Um, like the outfits that I always select from Revolve that they have in their little gifting suite are always like little two-piece sets. Um, basically barely their clothing and I just think it makes it, all those things like that look a lot edgier when you've got something like this to go with it um but I'm also they were 110 pound 19 maybe even geez it's a lot and I honestly don't think I'll wear them apart from there and maybe like photos and fashion weeks and things like that but I mean I'm not even going to be allowed to wear them on a date with my boyfriend or, you know, if I wear them for coffee with my mum, she'll make fun of me. It's just, I mean, I know I shouldn't care, but I just know me and I know I won't get that much wear out of them. Like, they're just so big as well. Like, I would take them skiing and be like, don't make fun of me. They've got good grip and they look fashionable. But they're just so big and heavy. Like, you can't take them anywhere. That's another thing. Like, if I do go to LA with them, I would have to wear them on the plane, in the car, like, everything I do, because they won't fit in my luggage and they're too heavy. But I do think they're going to look cool, so I'm going to show you them on now, probably with the Gucci tights and the cream wool jacket thing, because I think that's the kind of vibe that they're gonna look cool with like a bare leg look so that is it for today let me know what you want to see next it's not the biggest haul but i just thought don't want to pad it out just get some nice bits that i actually want so this is the boots i genuinely know how much you can see so i'm just gonna do that um i feel like this whole outfit is like extremely extra i'm not gonna lie but um yeah, this is what they look like. I'll show you. Thanks for watching. I know you guys love a Zara haul because these videos get the most views, but my subscribers are so low. So if you could subscribe, that would really make me happy because I don't know, like, I go up like one per video, but the video has like 10,000 views and I just don't get it. One in 10,000 of you want to subscribe. Please help me out. Have a nice day. Thanks for watching. See you soon.